The Food and Agriculture Organization says 26.5 million Nigerians face food crisis as poverty surges in the country, leaving many households unable to make ends meet due to the current economic climate, which has seen record-breaking food inflation. In this report, Trust TV's Idris Jabrin takes a look at Nigeria's quest to attain food security. His report is presented from our studio. With Nigeria already battling endemic poverty and hunger, the Food and Agriculture Organization say an estimated 25 million Nigerians are currently food unsecured. The figure is expected to rise to 26.5 million in the coming year. Poverty and climate change, persistent violence in Nigeria's northeast, armed banditry and kidnapping in the northwest are believed to be the major contributory factors to Nigeria's food insecurity. Food security is a core issue in development of uh, people in Nigeria, not only in Nigeria, but the world over. So Kano State Government is really trying to partner, like I said, with different stakeholders, especially donor and uh, donor agencies, in ensuring that food is made available to the people of the state. You know, Kano State is the highest state uh, with the highest population in Nigeria. We are talking about about 20 million people. And uh, God so kind, Kano State is blessed that 75 percent of this population are actively engaged in agricultural value chain. This is Dawano Grain Market in Kano. It is one of the largest grain markets in Africa. A truck lots of food items are transported from this market to different parts of the world. But despite the availability of the grains and other food items, Nigerians are compelled to buy food at exorbitant prices. Maize is now sold at 44, 43,000 naira per pack, which is very difficult for the poor man to afford. According to this expert, who recently met in Kano to brainstorm on the challenges and possible solutions, achieving food security in Nigeria requires investment in sustainable agricultural prices. Supporting smallholder farmers in rural farming communities, as well as encouraging dry land agriculture among other interventions so an agricultural development project in which is now focusing on production especially climate resilience crop and especially nutrition sensitive crops we expect that the farmers will have improved incomes there have been improved food security both for the farming families as well as the country we expect there will be improvement in nutritional values at the household level. We also expect that there will be climate resilient production, especially in this northern environment where we are facing a lot of climate hazards. President Tinibu recently declared a state of emergency on the nation's food crisis. But for most Nigerians, the declaration has done little to change the trajectory of food insecurity as millions remain at risk of hunger.